What's going on guys? My name is Shadowgoo131 and we're back tonight with our week 7 NPL battle taking on the Toledo Typhlosion. And you guys, I'm feeling kind of bad about it, but I am not changing up the team at all. We've got the same sets that we ran the last time. Um, it worked pretty well. There wasn't really anything that I would change. We've got our ditto. We've got our balls. Um... The only thing that I'm really worried about is their Zoroark, and I mean, they've got Drake. I mean, I'm, I guess I'm worried about everything. I hate their team, really, I really do. Um, but I think this team should be able to do it. Um, we, we've got a lot of hard-hitting, fast power, and then we've got our utility stuff down here, so I'm hoping, hoping, hoping that these guys can come through, but we will just have to wait and see uh, who they end up bringing but let's go ahead and jump right in here. So, they are rocking the Charizard, Mega Charizard Y, the Electivire, the Mamoswine, the Suicune, the Mew, and the Dragonite. So, if they lead a Suicune, Balls can't touch it. Balls can really only, is it only a good lead against Mega Charizard Y. Level 50. Let me just see what Balls looks like. What's he called? Fortress. So an explosion does kill. Um, we would live a fire blast. We would live a flamethrower. I always forget to say good luck to them. Okay, but I'm not predicting that. Who's he, who's Fortress weak to? Fire. That's always weak to. So if, if it's up against the Suicune... Explosion does about half. I'm gonna I'm gonna lead, I'm leading balls. He does lead the Charizard. It is not a Zoroark. I'm gonna do the exact same thing and go for the toxic spikes. So we'll live on sturdy. We'll get our toxic spikes up. And now we can explode. He lives! You live on one! You live on one! Okay. Now, now we can ditto and get a Mega Charizard Y, you guys. And we're gonna be faster. We're gonna be faster. He's at 1%. So what do we, what do we want here? I think we really want to go for Solar Beam. Electivire's weak to ground. Um, Mammal Swine. So we, uh, I'm going for Solar Beam. <laughs> we, get, we get a crit, and we kill their Mega Charizard. Ditto is crazy, you guys. So Ditto kills Mega Charizard. Mega Charizard kills Fortress. And we are up against a Mew. That is probably the only thing that's not good for us here. So we've got Mega Charizard Y Wall Breaker. Solar Beam's not going to touch this thing. It does 33%. Even if, he, all, if all he's got is Psychic. Um... At, with the poison, that's going to hurt. He is going to go for defog. That removes his toxic spikes. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. Okay, that's fine, though. We've we got a couple more solar beams. We might be able to get out of this thing. He does have Thunderbolt. It is super effective on us. And we do get the Paralyze. <laughs> the Para, though. Oh, the Para sucks. And he does have soft oil. I forgot about that. And the sun is gone. We're trapped and cannot switch. How are we trapped and cannot switch? That's no fun. There. Okay, now we can switch. I am going to save Ditto. So, what do we have for Mew? Bug Ghost Dark. This Mew we don't have much for. Bug Ghost Dark. Sockum can take care of a Mew. 
Infernape. Fire Punch will kill. And we do outspeed. Oh, but we can't. We can't take a uh, Thunderbolt. Okay, so we know we've seen... Oh, he's going to soft boil, so we can switch out to sock him. That's fine. We've seen Thunderbolt. Let's see how much Thunderbolt does. Whoops, not Thunder Wave. Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt doesn't do that much. Psychic will kill us. I'm going to go for the Fire Punch. Does 47. Psychic's going to kill... Oh, he gets a crit, but it does not matter. Okay, that sucks. I really probably should have been more careful there. Mew kills Infernape. All right, what are we going to do here? What are we going to do? Mew's at 1%. He's going to go down. Let's go ahead and get ourselves a Mew. And, oh. Oh, that's interesting. We're going to... Oh, he's going to soft boiled. Oh, I should... Oh, no. He's still faster than us. Okay, so we're going to soft boil it as well. And now we're just going to switch out to... Drogon, right? Drogon's faster. Drogon could kill. Uh, not at that range. Garchomp. Garchomp can't kill at that range. Earthquake does a good amount, though. And Psychic does not touch us. Are we weak to Thunderbolt? Probably. Oh, no, no we're not. Somehow. Okay, so we might as well Swords Dance here. And you know what? We're just going to Swords Dance again. He's going to go for Psychic. It's not going to do that much. And we're going to go for the Earthquake. And Mega Garchomp kills Mew. And we're up against a Mammal Swine. Who is good on us? Mammal Swine. Say he's Life Orb. He's base 80. Fully invested. Mega Garchomp. What does our Mega Garchomp speed look like? 311 fully invested? How does that. Oh, because that's level 100. I was going to say, there's no way. Okay, fully invested. We still outspeed. Unless this thing has some kind of choice item. Is that even a cho is that an option? It is. Let's see, I don't think we would outspeed. We do outspeed if it's choice scarfed. And at at our range, three times attack, I don't know, we'll say plus two. Earthquake should kill. And if we mega evolve, we'll be even stronger. Ice shard. Oh, I forget about Ice Shard. How do I forget about Ice Shard? It's priority. Okay, that sucks. I forgot about Ice Shard. I forgot about Ice Shard. How could I forget about Ice Shard? Mammo. Man. I just think, you know, I think I'm going to set up Mega Garchomp, and I think I'm going to sweep with him, and then every single time we get outplayed. Okay, this thing is weak too. Fighting Steel, Fire, Water, Grass. So, how well does Ginger take Melodic? Guys, this was going to be my first loss. A Scald kills this thing. But we don't outspeed. And we know it has Ice Shard. Ice Shard does not touch a Ginger. Alright, Melodic. I need you to hang in there. Earthquake's going to hurt. But a Scald should kill. He is going to switch out to Electivire. Scald does 50%. And we get the burn, Ginger. Ginger, no way. We don't outspeed an Electivire. I'm sure of it. We definitely don't. And a Wild Charge does kill. Um, but if we go out to a Ditto. Or what if we go out to Salamence? What if we go out to Salamence? Ice Punch kills. But an Earthquake would kill. So, let's go out to... He's not going to Ice Punch. He can't be Ice Punching. 
There's no way he's going. He, there's no way he goes for ice punch. He goes for thunder punch. Thank God. All right, so he's gonna take some burn damage, and we're just gonna earthquake. All right, Salamence. kills who was that electivire all right we're doing okay we're hanging in there and now we're b back up against a mammal swine you're not good on us we do have the ice shard though he is good on us draco meteor kills draco meteor ice shard oh why can't i remember that that's priority why can't i remember that that's priority all right we need a mammal swine. We are paralyzed. Um, so if we've got ourselves a mammal swine, we don't know what item it has. That's okay. Earthquake does a good amount, but we're going to get fully paralyzed. We live, and he lives way better. He is faster than us, so I guess... I don't know why. Is it because we're paralyzed? I think it's because we're paralyzed. All right, we'll keep we'll keep Ditto for one more thing. Ginger's gonna take an ice shard. Uh, that's fine. We're gonna go for Scald here. We're gonna go for Scald here. Come on, Ginger. Oh, someone killed Salamence. Who killed Salamence? Um, Mammo. All right, we just gotta stall him out. We've got a ditto that we might be able to... Oh, we've still got a full health Dragonite. He's weak to ice, though. He is weak to ice. And we've got a Suicune who we've beat in stall fights before. So we've got... There's hope. There is hope yet. Does Mamoswine... It's a speed... No, let me see. I think Mamoswine outspeeds a Melodic. He does not... Well, yeah, fully invested he does. Fully invested, he does. Come on, Ginger. What are you guys going to do? What are you going to do, Toledo Typhlosion? You do switch out to Suicune. That's fine. Get the burn. Come on, Ginger. Get the burn. Get the burn. Get the burn. No burn. No burn. That's okay. He does have leftovers. So we're up against the Suicune. So this is just going to be. He does have leftovers. That's interesting. Our Skull does more. Why does our Scald do more? Oh, uh, because that's probably not the Suicune that it is. Let's pick this one. So if it has Hydro Pump, that, I mean, it's just going to do the same amount as Scald, and we are more full health. He is going to put up a sub, um, and it takes a lot to break a sub. It does take a lot to break a sub. He is going to set up... Oh my god, I forgot about this. know what no that's okay we're paralyzed oh my god if we're paralyzed though that sucks because that's gonna hit our speed all right so i don't i don't know how much that's gonna do but still that does only 20 percent his special defense is higher though um so we really just need to hope for the burn we do have rest still that's so that's our that's our biggest thing is that we can still rest we do get the burn. We do get the burn. That's amazing. I'm just going to keep scalding. This is crazy. Alright, so we are... Ah, I'm going to scald again. This next one we're going to have to switch, or we're going to have to rest. If he gets a crit, I swear to God... If he gets a crit, I swear to God. Thank you. Oh, but he gets the burn. Oh, but that's perfect. That is perfect. We can outstall this thing all day. He switches out. Okay, so here's the Dragonite. <laughs> of course. Oh, God. I... Dragonite. Let's say it's this one. There's no reason. Ice Beam kills, though. Ginger, come on. Alright, we live in outrage. Go for Ice Beam. 
Dang it. Oh my god, of course. All right, so we are going to wake up here. Outrage looks like it is going to kill at that range. How much did it do? Outrage did 47. Ice Beam doesn't kill. Who am I, th who am I kidding? All right, so we need. We just need to rest again. So we're gonna, oh, he's confused though. Oh, but he has a Lumberry. Okay, so that's a that's a pretty good strategy. So we gotta we need to count on the sleep talk to come through. Every dang time. Are you kidding me, Ginger? Please. All right, that's okay. Yes, yes, Ginger, you are amazing. All right, that was two turns of sleep. So we're gonna rest again. Oh, he gets a crit. Crit right when it matters. Okay, ditto. We're going to take all of those stats. And we're going to go Dragonite level 50 with Outrage, Dragon Dance, Ex Earthquake, and Ice Punch. Ice Punch. Outrage. Earthquake probably doesn't touch it. I'm gonna go for Ice Punch. I don't. If we get, oh, he is out. He outspeeds. Oh man, that sucks. That sucks so bad. All right. That is our first loss, you guys. Your Detroit Red Gyarados moved to five and one after six games so far. It is game week seven, game six. We are five and one. I think that ties us with. I think that ties us with uh, Grass Lake Greninjas, which is crazy. Um, which is crazy. I don't know what that improves the Toledo Typhlosion to, um, but I knew that they were coming for me. They told me they were coming for me, and that was a really good game. We could have, if we could have outstalled. Um, I mean, we did outstall the Suicune. Ginger is a beast. Ginger is a beast. So Mammal kills Salamence, and then what happened? Let me. Oh my god, we scalded for so long. So, Mammo... Mammo killed Salamence, and then... And then it was the Scald Fest. So then... Ginger died from... Ginger fainted from Dragonite. Melodic, and, and then what? Ditto. Dragonite kills Ditto. Alright, you guys, if you are enjoying these NPL battles, of course, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you guys subscribe so you don't miss next week's battle. I can't remember who we play next week at this moment. Um, I can't remember who we play next week. I want to say it's Philly. Let me check. I can check real quick. Next week we do play Philly, so we count, we killed three and they killed six. So that is our first loss, you guys. We we had such a good run, we had such a good run, and our team fought hard. Ditto fought hard. Oh man, that mammal swine is no joke. That mammoth swine is no joke. But alrighty, that's going to do it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.